Hey, how you guys doing? Thanks for joining me today. So it's been a crazy, crazy busy past few weeks. I don't know about for you guys, but it's been just hectic. I don't know, something about the time of year, I guess. I started this new project, which I cannot wait to share with you guys. So far, I've got like 136 clips, 136 different steps, 136 different camera angles, and I'm still not even close to being done with the project yet. Oh man, I'm super excited about sharing this new project with you guys too, by the way, because it's one of those kind of projects that I feel like, you know, you probably have never seen anything like it before. In fact, I've searched all around trying to find something similar to it, but, you know, I haven't been able to find anything like it. And I'm certainly hoping that it's going to be an awesome video. Of course, all the videos we hope are going to be awesome, huh? I've been super busy, okay? Super busy. Here, look at this mess. Check out this mess I've been making here. See the mess on my table? Look at that. Look at this mess. Whoa, what is all this, huh? So I got to take this little road trip this past week on Monday. Did you know that there was a maker meetup going on? I didn't know it either until after I watched Jimmy DeResta's vlog video where he said he was going to be in Cleveland, Ohio and Lincoln Electric was hosting a maker meetup event. As soon as I heard that there was something going on, man, I was scouring the internet trying to find any information that I could find. So I ended up sending a tweet out to Jimmy to find out what was going on with this event to see how long he was going to be in Cleveland, Ohio. And thanks to Brian Prusa who provided me with the information about the event, I found out that not only was Jimmy DeResta going to be there, but Izzy Swan was going to be there, Laura Kumpf was going to be there, April Wilkerson, and many others. So I couldn't pass up an opportunity like this to hang out with such great people, especially since it was so close to home. Well, if you couldn't tell, the lighting in there was pretty horrible, and as far as I was concerned, it was way too loud. So that was all the video I managed to capture for the evening. Which, in a way, is actually a good thing, because if you're too busy trying to document the experience, then the odds are is you're probably not really experiencing the experience. And to me, it's far more important to create good memories than it is to create good videos. Overall, I'd have to say it was a really awesome experience and great to meet so many fellow makers. Well, that's going to be it for this one. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I really appreciate it. And if you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more, subscribe and turn on those notifications. And if you want to join me in a conversation, leave me some comments below or jump over on Twitter or Instagram. We'll see you next time. Oh, it's ours.